Hello and welcome to our latest group SFT tapping event. I'm Marvin Schneider. And I'm Jen Ward. Hi, everybody. Thank you for being Thanks. here. Hi. Good to see everyone. Thanks for joining us um, yep. on your Friday afternoon for a lot of people. It's our Saturday morning. For those that are not familiar with our group tapping events, we do these fairly regularly. It's part of our mission to uplift all of humanity, 8 billion people on the planet, and then various other th species on the planet. Um, and we typically do these tapping events on focused subjects, but this one's called Everything But the Kitchen Sink, which is a it's an interesting title for a group tapping event. But um, Jen, as a background, a lot of these taps came to you in the middle of the night over the course of about a week or so. So the fact that they came to you and you wrote them down clearly means that they're important and relevant for all of humanity. So that's what we're doing here today. Yep, absolutely. So we've done so much energy work for the last 15 years, taps on everything. And then I, I just ask, what else can we do? What else can we do? Because I still feel the psychic energy of, you know, power mongers, whatever. So I wake up in the middle of the night and they give me a word or a phrase that's really vital to dissipate, just like an enzyme would dissipate a stain on a, a shirt. These words, these vibrations and taps are like enzymes to break up the, the psychic energy of a movement of energy to try to um, to stifle the individuality of people. Yeah. Um, what else do you want to say? I mean, you're right. We've been doing energy work at the collective level for, well, you've been doing it for about 15 years. I've been doing it with you for about three or four. Mm -hmm. um, it's a lot. And right. um, we continue to do it. That's the thing. So these individual tabs I put out, some people, some people who are on my social media here um, will tell you that they're really tough to say one by one, and they're jam-packed because a lot of people on social media can only handle doing one tap at a time. That's what they enjoy doing. But right here, as a group, it's going to add an impact to these little um, energetic enzymes of... of um, Good intentions. Hmm. We've got, I hope everyone can join us for about an hour and a half. There's about 100 taps to do. I think I counted them up, 97. Um, let me just quickly just cut back because uh, we're going to be doing some production work on this afterwards, but let's cut back into the Zoom, Zoom studio audience guests. Um, quick, hi, everyone. Thanks for joining us. Um, quick check. Has everyone... <laughs> been able to and worked out how to download and get access to the taps that we're going to be doing today because it might be useful to have them in front of you as you're doing them. Beautiful. Um, some of them are a little bit longer than others, but um, yeah. yeah. These are tongue twisters, a little bit of them, but they are what they are. There's something fairly special about the taps that you construct, Jen. I've said it on so many of these videos that we put out there. Um, there is something poetic in the way that these taps are constructed. And um, perhaps you can quickly talk about that for those that are new to tapping, the way that the way you construct these taps. A, so two things that I'd like you to talk about. One is the extent to which they operate on all levels of consciousness and in all moments. And then the other thing is the way that it bypasses the ego. They're pretty, pretty important aspects to the work that we're doing here. Yeah, so so for my part, I don't know if anyone has has had the balls or been dumb enough to think that something they can do themselves can change consciousness. That's a beauty. This this work that we're doing with Tappins is hiding in plain sight. It doesn't occur to people that they can actually actually make a shift in the world. Like, here's an example. It's like people will have an infestation of bees or birds or wasps or something. And I always go to them, I go, did you ever ask the bees, the wasps to leave? Or have you asked the um, birds to leave your pond alone and stop eating the frogs? They haven't done that. So I've gone in and I've done that for them. And sure enough, consciousness will respond. So it doesn't occur to individuals that they're that empowered that what their intentions are can affect 
the collective. So that's what we're addressing here. As for the taps themselves, it's like all of the thoughts, feelings, emotions, and actions of human human um, consciousness is all tangled into this big mass. And what the what the taps are doing is um, going to that knot. If you've ever untangled a mass of string, you have to go to the main knot and dig that one string out and pull it out, and then everything else will loosen. So these taps are like going to this knot of tangled human consciousness, going to that one thread that needs to be pulled out so everything else will loosen, and then you will you will feel um, the expansion from that, and then you'll go into an after another knot. That's what we do. Hmm. And while the taps themselves might seem to be meandering and fairly random, the way that they are threaded together to untangle that knot and then just pull the threads apart is pretty pretty special. Um, I want to touch on something else before we uh, get into the main event. Uh, that is a lot of these group tapping events that we do are addressing core issues at the collective level. And so um, as much as we uh, have the intention of living in higher consciousness and having the lived experience of being in higher consciousness, um, the there is a lot of uh, disconcerting energies and behavior that still uh, lingers around us. So here's the thing. A lot of people, some people comment and say, you know, uh, oh, this group tapping stuff, you'll never change, you know, human nature and whatever. My response is pretty simple. If, if the issues that we're addressing, world peace, abundance, uh, providence, um, purpose, if those things are relevant to 8 billion people on the planet and we don't observe them at the moment and there are fundamental issues, if those issues could be solved through the conscious mind, then they would have already been done. And the fact that they haven't been solved means that humans themselves through their you know physical beavering activity can't solve these issues. So about the only way you can solve them is in energy because everything in the universe is energy, whether you realize it or not, Jen. Why don't you pick up on that conversation? Yes, good point. And the other thing that I get from people who who benefit so much from the tapping and stuff, they don't want to do these group events because they say, "No, I just want to work on myself. I, you know, I'm tired of of doing these tapping events to help all of humanity." But they're missing the point. You know the expression: "If you want to learn something, teach it." Same mm -hmm. thing. If you want higher consciousness on the world be a part of bringing it. So the individuals who think that they're just here for themselves are wrong. And the ones who think they're just here to help humanity are wrong. You can't, you can't disconnect from your connection to the collective. You are a conduit, a surrogate for all of humanity to reach higher consciousness. And everything you can do for yourself, you're doing it for others. So we're just doing that backwards. Everything you do for others, you are actually doing for yourselves. Now, individuals have been trained to not love themselves, to put themselves last, to think that it's very spiritual to be unworthy and in poverty and all these things. That's backwards. That's a form of sabotage because all of these things are available to you. Now, if you can't do it by loving yourself, what you do is you send out that love and intention to all the collective. And what it does is circles back around into you and the individual. And you will be uplifted by what you send out their intentions. It's spiritual law. People mm. have lost their understanding of spiritual law, but this is spiritual law. Yeah, I think that's a great reminder. I mean, um, the work that we do here and the work that you are doing and those that are going to watch this after the fact, um, uh, you know, it really is, th this is where the work's happening. So uh, I know that everyone, you know, 8 billion people on the planet have their ordinary lives to live and they've got, you know, jobs and other responsibilities. But at the end of the day, this is really at the apex of, you know, what we're here to do. So 
Um, I'm very grateful for those that are willing to invest an hour, hour and a half every sort of couple of weeks to help, uh, A, help themselves, and in the process of doing that, help all of humanity. So um, good call to action. Thank you for reminding um, us. Yes, babies, that's so awesome. And one more thing comes to mind for me is those of those people who um, who think this is anti Jesus or anti Christian, if they'll go back and read their Bible and read the messages of Jesus from his lips as best as it was interpreted, those messages that he gave were spiritual law. They're directly related to the work we do here, the golden rule. Do unto others as you want done to yourself. He's basically saying, do the task with Chen and Marvin 2,000 years from now. It, it, it's, it's, it's fundamental, people. I must have missed that interpretation in my readings of things oh, uh, back in I, the day. <laughs> back yeah. in the day? Yeah. Well, no, I remember, yeah, when I was a little girl, I would read the Bible, but I would only read Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, because all I wanted was to know and be um, immersed with what Jesus was really thinking and 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 being. And I couldn't, I couldn't. Um, after he was crossed over or whatever, it didn't mean anything to me. It was just absorbing the vibration of what he was telling and internalizing that. So that's what I've done as as my Christian kind of um, connection. Hmm. All right. Um, there's a lot of taps to be done. I hope you've, everyone on the call has the taps in front of them. Um, all right. Do you want to quickly explain for those that are new to this, possibly watching on YouTube after the fact, how this all operates? Yes. So um, I'm going to be saying a statement. It's an intention for all of the universe to... Um, yeah, and the synergy of us doing the tasks together are going to make it impactful. It's the spiritual law of unity. One plus one doesn't equal two. One plus one is exponential. And you have a few of us on the call. What we add together is empowerment for all of humanity. So I'm going to give feed a statement out to you guys. And what you're going to do is you're going to say it three times. We'll tap in the top of your head continuously. Then a fourth time we'll tap in middle of your chest and a fifth time will tap in your abdomen now if you get lost in the words marvin will be saying them so don't do the mental worry about oh I'm, they're ahead of me or whatever just follow along with the tapping at the same time and even though you're stumbling with the thoughts that's normal at first because it's like we're breaking through the limitations of the ego so you might stumble and, and get lost and the ego will want you to like worry about that just relax your atoms and follow along with Marvin and, and, and let the um, vibrations of what we're saying um, work for you and absorb that that way. Am I saying that right, babies? Clear enough? No, that's pretty good. So everyone on the Zoom call is on mute uh, so we don't compete in audio. And as best as possible, if you can follow along with me at the pace that I'm doing it, um, I'm, I do it as at a fairly manageable pace. So... Yes. Also, and Marvin's always concerned about this part. Sometimes I will do sound healing. I will break into song. It's only to like <laughs> give people a respite and so like let the energy work. And the fun amusement part of it is watch Marvin's face as I'm saying. <laughs> it's priceless amusement, people. Are you going to be doing any other sounds, um, your grunting noises? Is there... I'm happy to. That helps me move consciousness. I can do right. some if I do you want. All right. Do, are you guys so, comfortable with that? Yeah. Why don't yeah. you just explain that, though, uh, for those that are fairly new and don't really understand what's going on? Because it can be it, it can be a little bit disconcerting for those that don't know what's going on. So why don't you demystify what it is? That okay. You mean? It's really juicy people. So I'm a shaman and all of that means is I know how to move energy. I learned how to move energy when I went to massage therapy school. I can literally move the energy through someone's body through my intention and help their energy flow in their body. That's part of what I do in a private healing session. What we're doing now is I'm moving energy out of the collective and energy is energy. Sound is energy and stagnant 
crappy thoughts or feelings and emotions are energy. So what I'm doing is converting all the crappy energy in the world into sounds and just dissipating it. It doesn't exist anymore. And so when you hear my sounds, at first it's it's concerning and the ego will fight it like, oh my gosh, she sounds like a banshee or whatever. But um, what it's doing is once you get used to the sounds, you like welcome them because that will be you realizing how we're just dissipating this crap left and right. And um, pay, don't pay too closely attention to your body, but if you're aware of energy and how your body feels, get a sense of how these sounds make you feel individually more clear. Should I do a um, group release on everybody so they can get a sense of it in their own bodies? Right? Yeah, That's let's gonna... do that. Mm -hmm. You ready? <laughs> Someone, one of the newer people is feeling really hopeless, like <laughs> they've almost given up and <laughs> someone has a um their liver is full of the liver is a filter for the body so those of you who are new you might want to do the energetic cleanse with um your liver and clear out all the stagnant energy in your liver so do the energetic cleanse with um, stagnancy in the liver. <laughs> One of you has had your inner child crushed so bad that you don't even want to try anymore. I understand that. And it's okay. You're safe here. And your inner child can play with our inner ch children. And that's part of what we're doing here. <laughs> Someone is mind themselves so much, you got to let the mind go and stop trying so hard. Just relax your atoms. Some of you are still overcoming your past lives of being decapitated, hung, choked, ganged up on, grabbed from behind. So the neck issues are still there. And those are released, Nia. Yeah. Mm. Mm. There. Some, someone is still pinching their energy because they don't trust anything anymore. It's okay. Just try to be present and maybe your energy will unpinch as you do this. There's nothing I can say or do right now that's going to help you trust, except for you to like ease into the energy work. Is that good? Yep. I bet you those new people on the call didn't think that they were going to get a private healing, but there you go. And by the way, that is also relevant for anyone that uh, is watching this after the fact as well. So actually absolutely and that's that's the beauty of being here is all these people who show up constantly on these calls are my loved ones you're my family you're the ones who are getting the benefits of all my healing anything i'm capable of doing i do with you guys and you guys i think you hang in there even though i'm not always pleasant to be around you guys are hang in there because you know that when I'm harsh or something. I'm just breaking through a layer of the ego that needs to go so you can be more enjoy love, abundance, freedom, health, success, security, companionship, creativity, peace, life, wholeness, beauty, enthusiasm, contentment, spirituality, enlightenment, confidence, discernment, <sighs> empowerment, sincerity, integrity, and kindness. One of these days, I'm going to get you to recite that full list in one breath. Babies. And then I'll swim under pool, underwater for the same. Well, I'm doing <laughs> I, I thought you were going to say you're going to walk on water, but yeah, sure. You know, you know, I'm glad you brought that up. That analogy of walking on water mm -hmm. with um, water in that, in that instance is just the emotions. When Jesus walked on water, he was overcoming the emotions. 
So basically everyone on this call has already walked on water because you have overcome the emotional. Um, oh, oh, can I tell them about the very funny spiritual experience I had last night? <laughs> it's <all> hysterical, <laughs> you people. So our bedroom's here and then diagonal is the living room. And that's where my massage chair is, where I lay in and, and like let this massage chair just work me over so I don't get sick from all the energy work. So so last night I was in my massage chair and then I went back to bed, right? So when I so it in my soul body, I was out, I was back in the living room where the massage chair was, and I'm walking back into the bedroom, and there was Marvin in the bed in the massage chair and he was lay there and you know how he does goofy things and he does his imitations so marvin was in my chair making fun of me and he was doing marcel Marceau like in a box like really goofy it was hysterical i was laughing and he was sleeping through the whole thing it always amazes me the experiences that you have on the in the other realms babies <laughs> what, what else can i say Show show the new people your your goofiness so they can understand how funny it was. Show them the um happy birthday, Marilyn. No, 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 no. Uh, no. This is a serious event. All right. Sorry. All right, All let's right. get into it. Um, one other thing, just to mention for those that are new and those that are watching, uh, every now and then while during these tappings, Jen, you'll probably be, be doing a lot of yawning. So that's it's not that you're bored or anything. It's just part of the releasing process. So uh, just so you know that as well. Actually, when I was doing the yawning, what I was doing is not making my sounds. Yawning is a quiet way of making my sounds. So if I can make my sounds, you won't have to hear me yawn. Okay? That sounds good because yawning is the most in contagious, infectious thing on the planet. All right. Babies, stop, stop chatting all the time and let's get into it, babies. And then we'll do some taps. Babies. All right, here's the first one. <laughs> all those with God complex are immediately put in check in all moments. All those with God complex are immediately put in check in all moments. Mm. All those with God complex mm. are immediately put in check in all moments. All those with God complex are immediately put in check in all moments. All those with God complex are immediately put in check in all moments. All those with God complex are immediately put in check in all moments. I just want to say, notice it doesn't say to stop having a God complex, because when someone has a God complex, they're feeling their own empowerment. Where they get led astray is when they think that they're superior to everyone else. So every individual on the planet, please have a God complex, but let that, let that understanding know that everyone else afford that understanding to everyone else on the planet. Yeah. Okay. Good reminder. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, babies. All energies converging to enable a tyrant are immediately dispersed from the collective in all moments. All energies converging to enable a tyrant are immediately dispersed from the collective in all moments. All energies converging to enable a tyrant are immediately dispersed from the collective in all moments. All energies converging to enable a tyrant are immediately dispersed from the collective in all moments. All energies converging to enable a tyrant are immediately dispersed from the collective in all moments. All energies converging to enable a tyrant are immediately dispersed from the collective in all moments. Actually, Jen, can I just make this point? Um, I think it is going to be a little bit problematic from an audio perspective if you do make those noises. Okay, okay. okay so maybe, right. maybe, maybe yawning is is the way to go. <laughs> all right, babies, I got to do something. I got to be me. What I want to tell the viewers as well as we've been doing these tests for so long that we've gained a little edge on um, on humanity, on society. So when you do these tests, you can probably watch the news in real time and get a sense of them working. So you know who the tyrants of the world are. Watch how they get hoisted on their own petard in a very subtle way, maybe, maybe not so subtle, but this work is taking care of the autocrats of the world. Hmm. All tyrants are immediately thwarted from coagulating with other tyrants in all moments. 
All tyrants are immediately thwarted from coagulating with other tyrants in all moments. All tyrants are immediately thwarted from coagulating with other tyrants in all moments. All tyrants are immediately thwarted from coagulating with other tyrants in all moments. All tyrants are immediately thwarted from coagulating with other tyrants in all moments. All tyrants are immediately thwarted from coagulating with other tyrants in all moments. All tyrants immediately implode in their bullshit in all moments. All tyrants immediately implode in their bullshit in all moments. All tyrants immediately implode in their bullshit in all moments. All tyrants immediately implode in their bullshit in all moments. All tyrants immediately implode in their bullshit in all moments. All tyrants immediately implode in their bullshit in all moments. The next one is so important because a lot of people who are doing incredible energy work are, are not attracted money and they wondered why. Well, because the charge on money in the world has become so negative that their vibration is positive and it, it disperse it, it repels the money right now. We're changing the, the charge on money to neutral so that energy workers don't have to like be in poverty to do the work. It's really a power. Each one of these tasks is, is as, as thought out and as powerful as this, but it's going to take a lot of time if I explain each one and I, I'll annoy the bejesus out of Marvin. So I just want to <laughs> let you know what's going on with this tab because it's so important. <laughs> the negative charge on all money is immediately dissipated in all moments. The negative charge on all money <laughs> is immediately dissipated in all moments. The negative charge on all money is immediately dissipated in all moments. The negative charge on all money is immediately dissipated in all moments. The negative charge on all money is immediately dissipated in all moments. The negative charge on all money is immediately dissipated in all moments. Money diametrically shifts its paradigm from targeting nefarious endpoints to immediately glomming on those with truthful, level, loving, noble intentions in all moments. Money diametrically <laughs> shifts its paradigm from targeting nefarious endpoints to immediately glomming onto those with truthful, loving, noble intentions in all moments. <laughs> Money diametrically <laughs> shifts its paradigm from targeting nefarious endpoints to immediately glomming on those with truthful, loving, and noble intentions in all moments. Money diametrically shifts its paradigm from targeting nefarious endpoints to immediately glomming on those with truthful, loving, and noble intentions in all moments. Money diametrically shifts its paradigm from targeting nefarious endpoints to immediately glomming on those with truthful, loving, and noble intentions in all moments. Money diametrically shifts its paradigm from targeting nefarious endpoints to immediately glomming on those with truthful, loving, noble intentions in all moments. The monetization or demonization of everything sacred and pure is immediately thwarted in all moments. The monetization or demonization of everything sacred and pure is immediately thwarted in all moments. The monetization or demonization of any everything sacred and pure is immediately thwarted in all moments. The monetization or demonization of everything sacred and pure is immediately thwarted in all moments. The monetization or demonization of everything sacred and pure is immediately thwarted in all moments. The monetization or demonization of everything sacred and pure is immediately thwarted in all moments. Just quick pause. Um, Jen, do you find it interesting that as we're doing these taps, did you notice that we were being buzzed by um, uh, planes overhead? Two or three of them in formation. Did you notice that? Um, I didn't notice that, but thank you for bring my attention to another sort of interference. I'm dealing with psychic, mental, causal interferences, and you're, you're one, the one plugged into physical interferences. <laughs> so there's, that is a, a sabotage directly on you. And by the way, Myron, did you notice that it's like 1,002 degrees here in Australia right now <laughs> as we try to do this? It's pretty warm. Um, you're sweating, you can tell, but there you yeah, go. Yeah, I'm trying but, to pull you know, my hair back up. We just do the work. But <laughs> if you guys don't mind. It's 
not pretty people, but it's it is it pretty. Yes. It's okay. Mm -hmm. I don't want to lose my allure babies. <laughs> I love it how we can do the serious energy work and then goof at the same time. I think there is something in that. I love how he thinks I'm goofing. <laughs> <laughs> come on, we, let's get into it. We've got, we've got 100 babies. Come on, we, come on, babies. We immediately, we immediately break the fever of hate and derisiveness from the psyche of the collective in our moments. Mm, mm, mm. We immediately break the fever of hate and derisiveness from the psyche of the collective in all moments. We immediately break the fever of hate and derisiveness from the psyche of the collective in all moments. We immediately break the fever of hate and derisiveness from the psyche of the collective in all moments. We immediately break the fever of hate and derisiveness from the psyche of the collective in all moments. We immediately break the fever of hate and derisiveness from the psyche of the collective in all moments. All hate-based intentions are inoculated from, mis from metastasizing throughout the heart of humanity in our moments. All hate-based intentions are inoculated from metastasizing throughout the heart of humanity in all moments. All hate-based intentions are inoculated from metastasizing throughout the heart of humanity in all moments. All hate-based intentions are inoculated from metastasizing throughout the heart of humanity in all moments. All hate-based intentions are inoculated from metastasizing throughout the heart of humanity in all moments. All hate-based intentions are inoculated from metastasizing throughout the heart of humanity in all moments. All statements and intentions that are untrue, unnecessary, and unkind are immediately rendered dead energy and deactivated from swaying the course of public opinion in our moments. All statements and intentions that are untrue, unnecessary, and unkind are immediately rendered dead energy and deactivated from swaying the course of public opinion in all moments. All statements and intentions that are untrue, unnecessary, and unkind are immediately rendered dead energy and deactivated from swaying the course of public opinion in all moments. All statements and intentions that are untrue, unnecessary, <laughs> and unkind are immediately rendered dead energy and deactivated from swaying the course of public opinion in all moments. All statements and intentions that are untrue, unnecessary, and unkind are immediately rendered dead energy and deactivated from swaying the course of public opinion in all moments. All statements and intentions that are untrue, unnecessary, and unkind are immediately rendered dead energy and deactivated from swaying the course of public opinion in all moment. Because I think, I think that tap is going to do a lot. I mean, you'd, you'd have to be asleep not to understand what that tap is about. <laughs> What's interesting is just this tapping session that we're doing here, there's hundreds of thousands of people that are probably getting a healing from this because I feel it in their intestines where people store this, these issues, they store it in their bodies and I release, the noises help me release it. But yes, you're right, this is, that one tap is, yes. All attempts to recongeal humanity in lower consciousness is immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to recongeal humanity in lower consciousness is immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to recongeal humanity in lower consciousness is immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to recongeal humanity in lower consciousness is immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to recongeal humanity in lower consciousness is immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to recongeal humanity in lower consciousness is immediately thwarted in all moments. So this next one, I have to say something. So you know how there's a lot of personality worship on the planet, but it's mostly personality worship of a man, not usually a woman. You can admire a woman, but there's not the personality worship the same way. All of that is daddy issues. These are primordial ancestral daddy issues that we're addressing right now so that people don't have the propensity 
to worship a personality to get their needs met. Hmm. Good. Got it out, people. Good job. Self-love takes root in the collective as all ancestral wounds of daddy issues are healed in all moments. Self-love takes root in the collective as all ancestral daddy wounds of daddy issues are healed in all moments. Self-love takes root in the collective as all ancestral wounds of daddy issues are healed in all moments. Self-love takes root in the collective as all ancestral wounds of daddy issues are healed in all moments. Self-love takes root in the collective as all ancestral wounds of daddy issues are healed in all moments. Self-love takes root in the collective as all ancestral wounds of daddy issues are healed in all moments. So, so the pain that the collective is feeling right now is like when you have a seed that you need to like germinate, it, there's a process called stratifying where it hits pressure of cold or heat or something um, to like propel it to um, burst open and to germinate. So the collective is being stratified right now on the pain that you're seeing outwardly. So don't be so concerned with, you know, that the world is going to hell in a handbasket. It's just stratifying all the seeds to world peace. All the seeds to world peace are completely stratified, germinated, and planted in all moments. All the seeds to world peace are completely stratified, germinated, and planted in all moments. All the seeds to world peace mm -hmm. are completely stratified, germinated, and planted in all moments. All the seeds to world peace are completely stratified, germinated, and planted in all moments. All the seeds to world peace are completely stratified, germinated, and planted in all moments. All the seeds to world peace are completely stratified, germinated, and planted in all moments. Good job. All trolls and bullies are immediately eradicated from the human experience in all moments. All trolls and bullies are immediately eradicated from the human experience in all moments. All trolls and bullies are immediately eradicated from the human experience in all moments. All trolls and bullies are immediately eradicated from the human experience in all moments. All trolls and bullies are immediately eradicated from the human experience in all moments. All trolls and bullies are immediately eradicated from the human experience in all moments. We refuse to breathe life into engrams of hate in all moments. We refuse to breathe life into engrams of hate in all moments. We refuse to breathe life into engrams of hate in all moments. We refuse to breathe life into engrams of hate in all moments. We refuse to breathe life into engrams of hate in all moments. We refuse to breathe life into engrams of hate in all moments. We extinguish the fervor of hate and control through our healing, love, and calm in all moments. We extinguish the fervor of hate and control through our healing, loving, calm in all moments. We extinguish the fervor of hate and control through our healing, loving, calm in all moments. We extinguish the fervor of hate and control through our healing, loving, calm in all moments. We extinguish the fervor of hate and control through our healing, loving, calm in all moments. We extinguish the fervor of hate and control through our healing, loving, calm in all moments. We immediately thwart all monetizing of self-righteousness in all moments. We immediately thwart all monetizing of self-righteousness in all moments. We immediately thwart all monetizing of self-righteousness in all moments. We immediately thwart all monetizing of self-righteousness in all moments. We immediately thwart all monetizing of self-righteousness in all moments. We immediately thwart all monetizing of self-righteousness in all moments. All slights judgments and grievances that bind us to the lower consciousness are untethered in all moments. All slights, judgments and grievances that bind us to lower consciousness are untethered in all moments. All slights, judgments and grievances that bind us to lower consciousness are untethered in all moments. All slights, judgments and grievances that bind us to lower consciousness are untethered in all moments. 
All slights, judgments, and grievances that bind us to lower consciousness are untethered in all moments. All slights, judgments, and grievances that bind us to lower consciousness are untethered in all moments. We immediately release personifying apathy 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 in all moments. Isn't the word stranglehold a strong one? It's not a stronghold. It's tighter than a stronghold. It's a stranglehold, which well, cuts off the breath. It is a stranglehold. Between Stronghold is, is not as tight as a stranglehold. A stranglehold cuts off the oxygen to something. We remove the stranglehold that the biased, deceitful, and controlling factions have on the narrative of the collective in all moments. We remove the stranglehold that the biased, deceitful, and controlling factions have on the narrative of the collective in all moments. We remove the stranglehold that the biased, deceitful, and controlling factions have on the narrative of the collective in all moments. We remove the stranglehold that the biased, deceitful, and controlling factions have on the narrative of the collective in all moments. We remove the stranglehold that the biased, deceitful, and controlling factions have on the narrative of the collective in all moments. We remove the stranglehold that the biased, deceitful, and controlling factions have on the narrative of the collective in all moments. The sensationalizing or monetizing of human suffering is immediately thwarted. The sensationalizing and monetizing of human suffering is immediately thwarted in all moments. The sensationalizing and monetizing of human suffering is immediately thwarted in all moments. The sensationalizing and monetizing of human suffering is immediately thwarted in all moments. The sensationalizing or monetizing of human suffering is immediately thwarted in all moments. The sensationalizing or monetizing of human suffering is immediately thwarted in all moments. We thwart the conviction that any one sect, species, or other means of differentiating individuals holds a cornerstone of victimization or suffering in all moments. This one's a mouthful. I'm not exactly sure what what the what the tap is, but we can do it anyway. Just that's good because what it does is when you you don't know what the tap is, it's, it's bypassing the ego, and I'm glad that you don't know. <laughs> Above my pay grade, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> babies. A Burger King job is above our pay grade at this point, babies. Ay, ay, ay. All right, you ready? We thwart the conviction that any one sect, species, or other means of differentiating individuals holds the cornerstone of victimization or suffering in all moments. We thwart the conviction that any one sect, species, or other means of differentiating individuals holds the cornerstone of victimization or suffering in all moments. We thwart the conviction that any one sect, species, or other means of differentiating individuals holds the cornerstone of victimization or suffering in all moments. <laughs> we thwart the conviction that any one sect, species, or other means of differentiating individuals holds the cornerstone of victimization or suffering in all moments. We thwart the conviction that any one sect, species, or other means of differentiating individuals holds the cornerstone of victimization or suffering in all moments it's just the back end of that tap that just i right. didn't couldn't work through the first uh the first little bit was fine <laughs> right and it's just pulling out the knot which is fine i mean it's obvious what it means right no <laughs> okay it's just it's just we're dissipating the them versus us in victimization you know yeah we're, we're the best because we're treated the worst. And as soon as I say it in regular words, it's going to be construed as insensitive or wrong. So that's why we do it in energy where nobody can understand what I'm saying. So nobody gets offended. They don't know what the freak I'm saying. All right, let's go. All right, babies. 
Male energy is knocked off its perch of self-importance to recognize and synchronize with its vital symbiotic dance with female energy in all moments. Male energy is knocked off its perch of self-importance to recognize and synchronize with its vital symbiotic dance with female energy in all moments. Male energy is knocked off its perch of self-importance to recognize and synchronize with its vital symbiotic dance with female energy in all moments. Male energy is knocked off its perch of self-importance to recognize and synchronize with its vital symbolic symbiotic dance with female energy in all moments. Male energy is knocked off its perch of self-importance to recognize and synchronize with its vital symbiotic dance with female energy in all moments. Male energy is knocked off its perch of self-importance to recognize and synchronize with its vital symbiotic dance with female energy in all moments. Oh, babies, these are getting longer and longer. <laughs> no, they're not. No, it's just because we're dealing with male energy, you're objecting. The first cause of any sect or demographic being targeted or victimized is eliminated in all moments. The first cause of any sect or demographic being targeted or victimized is eliminated in all moments. The first cause of any sect or demographic being targeted or victimized is eliminated in all moments. The first cause of any sect or demographic being targeted or victimized is eliminated in all moments. The first cause of any sect or demographic being targeted or victimized is eliminated in all moments. The first cause of any sect or demographic being targeted or victimized is eliminated in all moments. We ease the strain and pressure on those holding open portals for higher consciousness in all moments. You're welcome, by the way. <laughs> we ease the strain and pressure on those holding open portals for higher consciousness in all moments. We ease the strain and pressure on those holding open portals for higher consciousness in all moments. We ease the strain and pressure on those holding open portals for higher consciousness in all moments. We ease the same strain and pressure on those holding open portals for higher consciousness in all moments. We ease the strain and pressure on those holding open portals for higher consciousness in all moments. We release volleying the ball in lower consciousness of them versus us mode in all moments. We release volleying the ball in lower consciousness of them versus us mode in all moments. We release volleying the ball in lower consciousness of them versus us mode in all moments. We release volleying, volleying the ball in lower consciousness of them versus us mode in all moments. We release volleying the ball in lower consciousness of them versus us mode in all moments. We release volleying the ball in lower consciousness of them versus us mode in all moments. All tyrants are squeezed and extracted from the complexion of God as the blackhead zit that they are in all moments. <laughs> all tyrants are squeezed and extracted from the complexion of God as the black-headed zit that they really are in all moments. All tyrants are ex squeezed and extracted from the complexion of God as the black-headed zit that they really are in all moments. All tyrants are squeezed and extracted from the complexion of God as the black-headed zit that they really are in all moments. All tyrants are squeezed and extracted from the complexion of God as the black-headed zit that they really are in all moments. All tyrants are squeezed and extracted from the complexion of God as the black-headed zit that they really are in all moments. Could, did you watch me um, squeeze zits right then, babies? <laughs> yes, thank you. <laughs> Thanks for the visualization. <laughs> You're welcome. Female energy is stripped of her jealous tendency in all moments. Female energy is stripped of her jealous tendency in all moments. Female energy is stripped of her jealous tendency in all moments. Female energy is stripped of her jealous tendency in all moments. Female energy is stripped of her jealous tendency in all moments. Free male energy is stripped of her jealous tendency in all moments. Female energy is inoculated from attacking Gaia in all moments. Female energy is inoculated from attacking Gaia in all moments. 
Female energy is inoculated from attacking Gaia in all moments. Female energy is inoculated from attacking Gaia in all moments. Female energy is inoculated from attacking Gaia in all moments. Female energy is inoculated from attacking Gaia in all moments. The undercurrent of frustration fueled by hate is immediately dissipated in the surging tide of divine love in all moments. The undercurrent of frustration fueled by hate is immediately dissipated in the surging tide of divine love in all moments. The undercurrent of frustration fueled by hate is immediately dissipated in the surging tide of divine love in all moments. The undercurrent of frustration fueled by hate is immediately dissipated in the surging tide of divine love in all moments. The undercurrent of frustration <clears throat> fueled by hate is immediately dissipated in the surging tide of divine love in all moments. The undercurrent of frustration fueled by hate is immediately dissipated in the surging tide of divine love in all moments. The fever of hate is instantaneously broken as love cools the brow of humanity in all moments. The fever of hate is instantaneously broken as love cools the brow of humanity in all moments. The fever of hate is instantaneously broken as love cools the brow of humanity in all moments. The fever of hate is instantaneously broken as love cools the brow of humanity in all moments. The fever of hate is instantaneously broken as love cools the brow of humanity in all moments. The fever of hate is instantaneously broken as love cools the brow of humanity in all moments. Oh, what is love? Oh, what is love? <laughs> your face, baby, your face. <laughs> all of humanity is immediately knocked off out of their complacency in our moments all of humanity is immediately knocked out of their complacency in all moments all of humanity is immediately knocked out of their complacency in all moments all of humanity is immediately knocked out of their complacency in all moments all of humanity is immediately knocked out of their complacency in all moments. All of humanity is immediately knocked out of their complacency in all moments. All those sleepwalking through life are immediately snapped awake in all moments. All those sleepwalking through life are immediately snapped awake in all moments. All those sleepwalking through life are immediately snapped awake in all moments. All those sleepwalking through life are immediately snapped awake in all moments. All those sleepwalking through life are immediately snapped awake in all moments. All those sleepwalking through life are immediately snapped awake in all moments. The edges are softened on all those adverse to awakening in all moments. The edges are softened on all those averse to awakening in all moments. The edges are softened on all those averse to awakening in all moments. The edges are softened on all those averse to awakening in all moments. The edges are softened on all those averse to awakening in all moments. The edges are softened on all those aver adverse to awakening in all moments. I've been lonely. I've been waiting for you. I'm pretending. And that's all I can do. The love I'm sending ain't making it through to your heart. You've been crying, never letting it show. Always trying to keep it under control. You've got it down, but you're well on your way to the top. But there's something that you forgot. What about love? Don't you want someone who care about you? What about love? Don't let it slip away. What about love? I only want to share with you. You might need it someday. 
The portal to awakening is, is secured, opened, and protected by the truth, love, and kind intentions of the collective in all moments. The portal to awakening is, is secured, open, and, and protected by the truth, love, and kindness of the kind intentions of the collective in all moments. The portal to awakening is secured, open, and protected by the truth, love, and kind intentions of the collective in all moments. The portal to awakening is secured, open, and protected by the truth, love, and kind intentions of the collective in all moments. The portal to awakening is secured, open, and protected by the truth, love, and kind intentions of the collective in all moments. The portal to awakening is secured, open, and protected by the truth, love, and kind intentions of the collective in all moments. All attempts to undermine individuals as gods and goddesses in each other's eyes are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to undermine individuals as gods and goddesses in each other's eyes are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to undermine individuals as gods and goddesses in each other's eyes are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to undermine individuals as gods and goddesses in each other's eyes are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to undermine individuals as gods and goddesses in each other's eyes are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to undermine individuals as gods and goddesses in each other's eyes are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to sabotage gods and goddesses co-piloting humanity to higher consciousness are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to sabotage gods and goddesses co-piloting humanity to higher consciousness are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to sabotage gods and goddesses co-piloting humanity to higher consciousness are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to sab sabotage gods and goddesses co-piloting humanity to higher consciousness are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to sabotage gods and goddesses co-piloting humanity to higher consciousness are immediately thwarted in all moments. All attempts to sabotage gods and goddesses co-piloting humanity to higher consciousness are immediately thwarted in all moments. We release confusing anger and reverberating opinions as activism for change in all moments. We release confusing anger and reverberating opinions as activism for change in all moments. We release confusing anger and reverber reverberating opinions as activism for change in all moments. We release confusing anger and reverberating opinions as activism for change in all moments. We release confusing anger and reverberating opinions as activism for change in all moments. We release confusing anger and reverberating opinions as activism for change in all moments. We release confusing a lateral move of change with a shift and vantage point needed for mass awakening in all moments. We release confusing a lateral move of change with a shift in vantage point needed for mass awakening in all moments. We release confusing a lateral move of change with a shift in vantage point needed for mass awakening in all moments. We release confusing a lateral move of change with a shift in vantage point needed for mass awakening in all moments. We release confusing a lateral move of change with a shift in vantage point needed for mass awakening in all moments. We release confusing a lateral move of change with a shift in vantage point needed for mass awakening in all moments. We release equating spouting opinions with speaking your truth in all moments. We release equating spouting opinions with speaking your truth in all moments. We release equating spouting opinions with speaking your truth in all moments. We release equating spouting opinions with speaking your truth in all moments. We release equating spouting opinions with speaking your truth in all moments. We release equating spouting opinions with speaking your truth in all moments. We release digression from living our purpose to trafficking ignorance in all moments. 
we really digressing from living our purpose to trafficking ignorance in all moments. We really digressing from living our purpose to trafficking ignorance in all moments. We really digressing from living our purpose to traffic trafficking ignorance in all moments. We really digressing from living our purpose to trafficking ignorance in all moments. We really digressing from living our purpose to trafficking ignorance in all moments. We thwart the ignorant practice of demanding that eight billion pinpoints of light understand truth from our vantage point in all moments. We thwart the ignorant practice of demanding that eight billion pinpoints of light understand truth from our vantage point in all moments. We thwart the ignorant practice of demanding that eight billion pinpoints of life understand light understand truth from our vantage point in all moments. We thwart the ignorant practice of demanding that eight billion pinpoints of light understand truth from our vantage point in all moments. We thwart the ignorant practice of demanding that eight billion pinpoints of light understand truth from our vantage point in all moments. We thwart the ignorant practice of demanding that eight billion pinpoints of light understand truth from our vantage point in all moments. We free humans of wasting energy trying to sway eight billion others to their point of view in all moments. We free humans of wasting energy trying to sway eight billion others to their point of view in all moments. We free, free humans of wasting energy trying to sway eight billion others to their point of view in all moments. We free humans of wasting energy trying to sway eight billion others to their point of view in all moments. We free humans of wasting energy trying to sway eight billion others to their point of view in all moments. We free humans of wasting energy trying to sway eight billion others to their point of view in all moments. We release the belief that sharing our voice entails spouting opinions in all moments. We release the belief that sharing our voice entails spouting opinions in all moments. We release the belief that sharing our voice entails spouting opinions in all moments. We release the belief that sharing our voice entails spouting opinions in all moments. We release the belief that sharing our voice entails spouting opinions in all moments. We release the belief that sharing our voice entails spouting opinions in all moments. We release really seeing the enemy in any child's eyes in all moments. We release really seeing the enemy in any child's eyes in all moments. We release really seeing the enemy in any child's eyes in all moments. We release seeing the enemy in any child's eyes in all moments. We release seeing the enemy in any child's eyes in all moments. We release seeing the enemy in any child's eyes in all moments. We release teaching our children to squelch their sweetness through conforming to or deferring to the populace in all moments. We release teaching our children to squelch their sweetness through conforming or deferring to the populace in all moments. We release teaching our children to squelch their sweetness through conforming or deferring to the populace in all moments. We release teaching our children to squelch their sweetness through conforming or deferring to the populace in all moments. We release teaching our children to squelch their sweetness through conforming or deferring to the populace in all moments. We release teaching our children to squelch their sweetness through conforming or deferring to the populace in all moments. We release being contorted into an amalgamation of mass manipulation in all moments. We release being contorted into an amalgamation of mass manipulation in all moments. We release being contorted into an amalgamation of mass manipulation in all moments. We release being contorted into an amalgamation of mass manipulation in all moments. We release being contorted into an amalgamation of mass manipulation in all moments. We release being contorted into an amalgamation of mass manipulation in all moments. We release confusing the packages, the packaging and bullshit as ultimate truth in all moments. We release confusing the packaging on bullshit as the ultimate truth in all moments. 
We release confusing the packaging on bullshit as ultimate truth in all moments. We release confusing the packaging on bullshit as ultimate truth in all moments. We release confusing the packaging on bullshit as ultimate truth in all moments. We release confusing the packaging on bullshit as ultimate truth in all moments. We release the pursuit of collected minions on the way to self-empowerment in all moments. We release the pursuit of collecting minions on the way to self-empowerment in all moments. We release the pursuit of collecting minions on the way to self-empowerment in all moments. We release the pursuit of collecting minions on the way to self-empowerment in all moments. We release the pursuit of collecting minions on the way to self-empowerment in all moments. We release the pursuit of collecting minions on the way to self-empowerment in all moments. We release ignoring the awaken awakening of all life by pontificating on high regarding every new truth that we are discovering from within in our moments. We release ignoring the awakening of all life by pontificating on high regarding every new truth that we discover from within in all moments. We release ignoring the awakening of all life by pontificating on high regarding every new truth that we discover from within in all moments. We release ignoring the awakening of all life by pontificating on high regarding every new truth that we discover from within in all moments. We release ignoring the awakening of all life by pontificating on high regarding every new truth we discover from within in all moments. We release ignoring the awakening of all life by pontificating on high regarding every new truth that we discover from within in all moments. We release getting caught in the trap of old consciousness by believing that our personal path to awakening is superior to others in all moments. We release getting caught in the trap of old consciousness by believing that our personal path to awakening is superior to others in all moments. We release getting caught in the trap of old consciousness by believing that our personal path to awakening is superior to others in all moments. We release getting caught in the trap of old consciousness by believing that our personal path to awakening is superior to others in all moments. We release getting caught in the trap of old consciousness by believing that our personal path to awakening is superior to others in all moments. We release getting caught in the trap of old consciousness by believing that our personal path to awakening is superior to others in all moments. We release producing thought bubbles with Borg-like intentions to draw everyone in to be assimilated in our moments. We release producing thought bubbles with Borg-like intentions to draw everyone and everyone in and assimilate them in all moments. We release producing thought bubbles with Borg-like intentions to draw everyone in and assimilate them in all moments. We release producing thought bubbles with Borg-like intentions to draw everyone in and assimilate them in all moments. We release producing thought thought bubbles with Borg-like intentions to draw everyone in and assimilate them in all moments. We release producing thought bubbles with Borg-like intentions to draw everyone in and assimilate them in all moments. We release derailing others from their path to awakening by coercing them to sit at our feet in all moments. We release derailing others from their path to awakening by coercing them to sit at our feet in all moments. We release derailing others from their path to awakening by coercing them to sit at our feet in all moments. We release derailing others from their path to awakening by coercing them to sit at our feet in all moments. We release derailing others from their path to awakening by coercing them to sit at our feet in all moments. We release derailing others from their path to awakening by coercing them to sit at our feet in all moments. We release the belief that every fart we utter in our quest for awakening deserves a public audience in our moments. Oh dear. We release the belief that every fart we utter in our quest for awakening deserves a public audience in all moments. We release the belief that every fart we utter in our quest for awakening deserves a public audience in all moments. 
We release the belief that every fight we utter in our quest for awakening deserves a public audience in all moments. We release the belief that every fight we utter in our quest for awakening deserves a public audience in all moments. We release the belief that every fight we utter in our quest for awakening deserves a public audience in all moments. We release all the bullshit bubble wrapped in awakening in all moments. We release all the bullshit bubble wrapped in awakening in all moments. We release all the bullshit bubble wrapped in awakening in all moments. We release all the bullshit bubble wrapped in awakening in all moments. We release all the bullshit bubble wrapped in awakening in all moments. We release all the bullshit bubble wrapped in awakening in all moments. We release trying to transcend using the same tools that have ensconced us in complacency in our moments. We release trying to transcend using the same tools that have ensconced us in complacency in all moments. We release trying to transcend using the same tools that have ensconced us in complacency in all moments. We release trying to transcend using the same tools that have ensconced us in complacency in all moments. We release using the same we release trying to transcend using the same tools that have ensconced us in complacency in all moments. We release trying to transcend using the same tools that have ensconced us in complacency in all moments. Someone just got a kidney healing. Their right kidney got uh, a huge release from that one. We remove the guru complex from those awakening in all moments. We remove the guru complex from those awakening in all moments. We re remove the guru complex from those awakening in all moments. We remove the guru complex from those awakening in all moments. We remove the guru complex from those awakening in all moments. We remove the guru complex from those awakening in all moments. We remove all engrams and muscle memory of pissing contests between those awakening in all moments. We remove all engrams and muscle memory of pissing contests between those awakening in all moments. We remove all engrams and muscle memory of pissing contests between those awakening in all moments. We remove all engrams and muscle memory of pissing contests between those awakening in all moments. We remove all engrams and muscle memory of pissing contests between those awakening in all moments. We remove all engrams and muscle memory of pissing contests between those awakening in all moments. We remove all spiritual elitism amongst those awakening in all moments. We remove all spiritual elitism amongst those awakening in all moments. We remove all spiritual elitism amongst those awakening in all moments. We remove all spiritual elitism amongst those awakening in all moments. We remove all spiritual elitism amongst those awakening in all moments. We remove all spiritual elitism amongst those awakening in all moments. I just have to say something that's coming through right now. See, I'm itching this. A lot of people who fixate on the third eye, the crown chakra, some other kind of part of the aspect to higher consciousness, they're getting it wrong. Every atom of your body is a portal to higher consciousness. Sometimes when you fixate on just one portal, you defer, you're taking yourself off, off um, the direction. So just expand your peripheral vision to be all encompassing to your whole beingness. And, and stop fixating on one spot. It's a linear mentality that's that's derailing a lot of people right now. We transcend all spiritual elitism to truly awaken in all moments. We transcend all spiritual elitism to truly awaken in all moments. We transcend all spiritual elitism to truly awaken in all moments. We transcend all spiritual elitism to truly awaken in all moments. We transcend all spiritual elitism to truly awaken in all moments. We transcend all spiritual elitism to truly awaken in all moments. Heaven just said that a lot of people's from watching this, a lot of people's spiritual eyes are opening. Not even from watching this, just from being present as we're doing this. So they might never know it comes from here. But 
Yeah, there's an opening happening. All dead energy is immediately extracted from social media in all moments. Yay. Yeah. All dead energy is immediately extracted from social media in all moments. All dead energy is immediately extracted from social media in all moments. All dead energy is immediately extracted from social media in all moments. All dead energy is immediately extracted from social media in all moments. All dead energy is immediately extracted from social media in all moments. All dead energy is immediately and thoroughly extracted from all of humanity in all moments. All dead energy is immediately and thoroughly extracted from all of humanity in all moments. All dead energy is immediately and thoroughly extracted from all of humanity in all moments. All dead energy is immediately and thoroughly extracted from all of humanity in all moments. All dead energy is immediately and thoroughly extracted from all of humanity in all moments. All dead energy is immediately and thoroughly extracted from all of humanity in all moments. All light workers, sound healers, tree hugging, fairy loving, wind walking, avatars, and incarnated adepts are extricated from the grip of the lower worlds in all moments. <laughs> I love this one. All light workers, sound healers, tree hugging, fairy loving, wind walking avatars are and incarnated adepts are extricated from the grip of the lower worlds in all moments. All light workers, sound healers, tree hugging, fairy loving, wind walking avatars and incarnated adepts are extricated from the grip of the lower worlds in all moments. All light workers, sound healers, tree hugging, fairy loving, wind walking avatars, and incarnated adepts are extracted from the grip of the lower worlds in all moments. All light working, sound healers, all light workers, sound healers, tree hugging, fairy loving, wind walking avatars, and incarnated adepts are extricated from the grip of the lower worlds in all moments. All light workers, sound healers, tree hugging, fairy loving, wind walking avatars, and incarnated adepts are extricated from the grip of the lower worlds in all moments. I'm, I'm listening to the wind of my soul. Where I end up, only God really knows. I sat upon the setting sun, but never, ever, never. I never wanted water once. I never, ever, never. We unrig the system in all moments. 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 The gaping fissure. Between the haves and the have-nots is sealed and healed in all moments. The gaping fissure between the haves and have-nots is sealed and healed in all moments. The gaping fissure between the haves and have-nots is sealed and healed in all moments. The gaping fissure between the haves and have-nots is sealed and healed in all moments. The gaping fissure between the haves and have-nots is sealed and healed in all moments. The gaping fissure between the haves and have-nots is sealed and healed in all moments. All hate, baked into political, religious ponds and sycophants, is immediately and thoroughly drained of its fervor in all moments. All hate, baked into political, religious pawns and sycophants, is immediately and thoroughly drained of its fervor in all moments. All hate baked into political, religious pawns and sycophants is immediately and thoroughly drained of its fervor in all moments. All hate baked into political, religious pawns and sycophants is immediately and thoroughly drained of its fervor in all moments. All hate baked into political, religious pawns and sycophants is immediately and thoroughly drained of its fervor in all moments. All hate baked into political, religious pawns and sycophants is immediately and thoroughly drained of its fervor in all moments. All hate baked into the collective is immediately and thoroughly drained out of existence in all moments. All hate baked into the collective is immediately and thoroughly drained out of existence in all moments. All hate baked into the collective is immediately and thoroughly drained out of existence in all moments. 
All hate baked into the collective is immediately and thoroughly drained out of existence in all moments. All hate baked into the collective is immediately and thoroughly drained out of existence in all moments. All hate baked into the collective is immediately and thoroughly drained out of existence in all moments. All blockages to all minions of power mongers getting the memo are removed in all moments. All blockages to all minions of power mongers getting the memo are, are removed in all moments. All blockages to all minions and power mongers getting the memo are removed in all moments. All blockages to all minions and power mongers getting the memo are removed in all moments. All blockages to all minions of power minions of power mongers getting the memo are removed in all moments. All blockages to all minions of power mongers getting the memo are removed in all moments. We release being landlocked in disappointment and futility in all moments. We release being landlocked in disappointment and futility in all moments. We release being landlocked in disappointment and futility in all moments. We release being landlocked in disappointment and futility in all moments. We release being landlocked in disappointment and futility in all moments. We release being landlocked in disappointment and futility in all moments. We release being pulled in the sweat of personal failure and disappointment. In all moments. We release being pulled in the sweat of personal failure and disappointment in all moments. We release being pulled in the sweat of personal failure and disappointment in all moments. We release being pulled in the sweat of personal failure and disappointment in all moments. We release being pulled in the sweat of personal failure and disappointment in all moments. We release being pulled in the sweat of personal failure and disappointment in all moments. We happily get caught in a riptide to higher consciousness in all moments. We happily get caught in a riptide to higher consciousness in all moments. We happily get caught in a riptide to higher consciousness in all moments. We happily get caught in a riptide to higher consciousness in all moments. We happily get caught in a riptide to higher consciousness in all moments. We happily get caught in a riptide to higher consciousness. In all moments, <clears throat> we harden the Arctic against being raped by economic exploration. In all moments, we harden the Arctic against being raped by economic exploration. In all moments, we harden the Arctic against being raped by economic exploration. In all moments, we harden the Arctic against being raped by economic exploration. In all moments. We harden the Arctic against being raped by economic exploration in all moments. We harden the Arctic against being raped by economic exploration in all moments. We reverse the melting of the ice caps with a massive Arctic freeze in all moments. We reverse the melting of the ice caps with a massive Arctic freeze in all moments. We reverse the melting of the ice caps with a massive Arctic freeze in all moments. We reverse the melting of the ice caps with a massive Arctic freeze in all moments. We reverse the melting of the ice caps with a massive Arctic freeze in all moments. We reverse the melting of the ice caps with a massive Arctic freeze in all moments. We eliminate the first cause of man breaking the spirit of Earth in all moments. We eliminate the first cause of man breaking the spirit of Earth in all moments. We eliminate the first cause of man breaking the spirit of earth in all moments. We eliminate the first cause of man breaking the spirit of earth in all moments. We eliminate the first cause of man breaking the spirit of earth in all moments. We eliminate the first cause of man breaking the spirit of earth in all moments. We infuse light, love, joy, encouragement, and empowerment into the earth through our planting, tilling, and sowing, sowing, sowing. In all moments. We infuse light, love, joy, encouragement, and empowerment into the earth through our planting, tilling, and sowing in all moments. We infuse light, love, joy, encouragement, and empowerment into the earth through our planting, tilling, and sowing in all moments. We infuse light, love, joy, encouragement, and empowerment into the earth through our planting, tilling, and sowing in all moments. 
We infuse light, love, joy, encouragement and empowerment into the earth through our planting, tilling and sowing in all moments. We infuse light, love, joy, encouragement and empowerment into the earth through our planting, tilling and sowing in all moments. We call out to all the whales of the world that we hear their pleas and are assisting them to survive by doing these taps in all moments. We call out to all the whales of the world that we hear their pleas and are assisting them to survive by doing these taps in all moments. We call out to all the whales of the world that we hear their pleas and are assisting them to survive by doing these taps in all moments. We call out to all the whales of the world that we hear their pleas and are assisting them to survive by doing these taps in all moments. We call out to all the whales of the world that we hear their pleas and are assisting them by, to survive by doing these taps in all moments. We call out to all the whales of the world that we hear their pleas and are assisting them to survive by doing these taps in all moments. We synergize our empowerment with the forces of all nature to prevent man from destroying himself by depleting the earth in all moments. We synergize our empowerment with the forces of all nature to prevent man from destroying himself by depleting the earth in all moments. We synergize our empowerment with the forces of all nature to prevent man from destroying himself by depleting the earth in all moments. We synergize our empowerment with the forces of nature of all nature to prevent man from destroying himself by depleting the earth in all moments. We synergize our empowerment with the forces of all nature to prevent man from destroying himself by depleting the earth in all moments. We synergize our empowerment with all force with the forces of all nature to prevent man from destroying himself by depleting the earth in all moments. We pour all our love and into every whale, tree, aspect of nature, and every grain of sand to give it the fortitude to thrive in all moments. We pour all our love into every whale, tree, aspect of nature and every grain of sand to give it the fortitude to thrive in all moments. We pour all our love into every whale, tree, aspect of nature and every grain of sand to give it the fortitude to thrive in all moments. We pour all our love into every whale, tree, aspect of nature and every grain of sand to give it the fortitude to thrive in all moments. We pour all our love into every whale, tree, aspect of nature and every grain of sand to give it the fortitude to thrive in all moments. We pour all our love into every whale, tree, aspect of nature and every grain of sand to give it the fortitude to thrive in all moments. We eliminate the first cause in gutting the earth for trinkets and plundering the land for trophies in all moments. We eliminate the first cause in gutting the earth for trinkets and plundering the land for trophies in all moments. We eliminate the first cause in gutting the earth for trinkets and plundering the land for trophies in all moments. We eliminate the first cause in gutting the earth for trinkets and gutting and plundering the land for trophies in all moments. We eliminate the first cause in gutting the earth for trinkets and plundering the land for trophies in all moments. We eliminate the first cause in gutting the earth for trinkets and plundering the land for trophies in all moments. The stronghold of greed is broken of those who propagate mass ignorance for personal gain in all moments. The stronghold of greed is broken of those who propagate mass ignorance for personal gain in all moments. The stronghold of greed is broken on those who propagate mass ignorance for personal gain in all moments. The stronghold of greed is broken on those who propagate mass ignorance for personal gain in all moments. The stronghold of greed is broken on those who propagate mass ignorance for personal gain in all moments. The stronghold of greed is broken on those who propagate mass ignorance for personal gain in all moments. We free the earth from being held hostage by the pea brain mentality of the selfish man in all moments, selfishness of man in all moments. We free the earth from being held hostage by the pea brain mentality of the selfishness of man in all moments. We free the earth from being held hostage by the pea brained mentality of the selfishness of man 
in all moments. We free the earth from being held hostage by the pea-brained mentality of the selfishness of man in all moments. We free the earth from being held hostage by the pea-brained mentality of the selfishness of man in all moments. We free the earth from being held hostage by the pea-brained mentality of the selfishness of man in all moments. We release the mass radicalization into ignorance in all moments. We release the mass radicalization into ignorance in all moments. We release the mass radicalization into ignorance in all moments. We release the mass radicalization into ignorance in all moments. We release the mass radicalization into ignorance in all moments. We release the mass radicalization into ignorance in all moments. All fauna, flora, and humans take back their empowerment and synergize the collective intention to co thrive in all moments. All fauna, flora, and humans take back their empowerment and synergize their collective intention to co thrive in all moments. All fauna, flora, and humans take back their empowerment and synergize the coll their collective intention to co thrive in all moments. All fauna, flora, and humans take back their empowerment and synergize the collective intention to co thrive in all moments. All fauna, flora, and humans take back their empowerment and synergize the collective intention to co thrive in all moments. All fauna, <laughs> flora, and humans take back their empowerment and synergize the collective intention to co thrive in all moments. We release being knocked out of balance by our own hormones in all moments. We release being knocked out of balance by our own hormones in all moments. We release being knocked out of balance by our own hormones in all moments. We release being knocked out of balance by our own hormones in all moments. We release being knocked out of balance by our own hormones in all moments. We release being knocked out of balance by our own hormones in all moments. We release being led astray from the heart by the from our heart by the stubborn mind in all moments. We release being led astray from our heart by the stubborn mind in all moments. We release being led astray from our heart by the stubborn mind in all moments. We release being led astray from our heart by the stubborn mind in all moments. We release being led astray by our from our heart by the stubborn mind in all moments. We release being led astray from our heart by the stubborn mind in all moments. We release being paralyzed at the lowest point of point by delving the depth of despair in all moments. We release being paralyzed at the lowest point by delving the depth of despair in all moments. We release being paralyzed at the lowest point by delving the depth of despair, but in all moments. We release being paralyzed at the lowest point by delving the depth of despair in all moments. We release being paralyzed at the lowest point by delving the depth of despair in all moments. We release being paralyzed at the lowest point by delving the depth of despair in all moments. We release being trapped in a prison of our own making by subscribing to crazed understandings of love and life in all moments. We release being trapped in a prison of our own making by subscribing to a crazed understanding of love and life in all moments. We release being trapped in a prison of our own making by subscribing to a crazed understanding of love and life in all moments. We release being trapped in a prison of our own making by subscribing to a crazed understanding of love and life in all moments. We release being trapped in a prison of our own making by subscribing to a crazed understanding of love and life in all moments. We release being trapped in a prison of our own making by subscribing to a crazed understanding of love and life in all moments. We release feeling the unrest of war and the suffering of the masses in our own body in all moments. We release feeling the unrest of war and the suffering of the masses in our own body in all moments. We release feeling the unrest of war and the suffering of the masses in our own body in all moments. We release feeling the unrest of war and the suffering of the masses in our own body in all moments. We release feeling the unrest of war and the suffering of the masses in our own body in all moments. We release feeling the unrest of war and the suffering of the masses in our own body in all moments. 
We heal the blight of all humanity by addressing issues in our own body and tending our own garden in all moments. We heal the blight of all of humanity by addressing issues in our own body and tending our own garden in all moments. We heal the blight of all of humanity by addressing issues in our own body and tending our own garden in all moments. We heal the blight of all of humanity by addressing issues in our own body and tending our own garden in all moments. We heal the blight of all of humanity by addressing issues in our own body and tending our own garden in all moments. We heal the blight of all of humanity by addressing issues in our own body and tending our own garden in all moments. We infuse love and light into all those who are oppressed by pouring love and kindness into our own dear ones in all moments. We infuse love and light into all those who are oppressed by pouring love and kindness into our own dear ones in all moments. We infuse love and light into all those who are oppressed by pouring love and kindness into our own dear ones in all moments. We infuse love and light into all those who are oppressed by pouring love and kindness in our own into our own dear ones in all moments. We infuse love and light into all those who are oppressed by pouring love and kindness into our own dear ones in all moments. We infuse love and light into all those who are oppressed by pouring love and kindness into our own dear ones in all moments. We release being led away from our true purpose by misunderstanding of what our true purpose entails in all moments. We release being led away from our true purpose by a misunderstanding of what our true purpose entails in all moments. We release being led away from our true purpose by a misunderstanding of what our true purpose entails in all moments. We release being led away from our true purpose by a misunderstanding of what our true purpose entails in all moments. We release being led away from our true purpose by a misunderstanding of what our true purpose entails in all moments. We release being led away from our true purpose by a misunderstanding of what our true purpose entails in all moments. We release curse in the world by agreeing with naysayers and power mongers who don't have the balls to step up to the plate in all moments. We release cursing the world by agreeing with naysay naysayers and power mongers who don't have the balls to step up to the plate in all moments. We release cursing the world by agreeing with naysayers and power mongers who don't have the balls to step up to the plate in all moments. We release cursing the world by agreeing with naysayers and power mongers who don't have the balls to step up to the plate in all moments. We release cursing the world by agreeing with naysayers and power mongers who don't have the balls to step up to the plate in all moments. We release cursing the world by agreeing with naysayers and power mongers who don't have the balls to step up to the plate in all moments. It's a technical term, babies. Yeah, I understood that. All of the disingenuous are immediately stripped of their ability to hide their true motives in all moments. All of the disingenuous are immediately stripped of their ability to hide their true motivations in all moments. Oh, actually, sorry, let's start that again. All of the disingenuous are immediately stripped of their ability to hide their true motives in all moments. All of the disingenuous are immediately stripped of their ability to hide their true motives in all moments. All of the disingenuous are immediately stripped of their ability to hide their true motives in all moments. All of the disingenuous are immediately stripped of their ability to hide their true motives in all moments. All of the disingenuous are immediately stripped of their ability to hide their true motives in all moments. All time and space is folded for all of humanity to tap into the wisdom, peace, freedom and empowerment that nature offers them in the present moment of the now, in all moments. All time and space is folded for all of humanity to tap into the wisdom, peace, freedom, and empowerment that nature offers them in the present moment of the now, in all moments. All time and space is folded for all of humanity to tap into the wisdom, peace, freedom, and empowerment that nature offers them in the present moment of the now, in all moments. 
All time and space is folded for all of humanity to tap into the wisdom, peace, freedom and empowerment that nature offers them in the present moment of the now in all moments. All time and space is folded for all of humanity to tap into the wisdom, peace, freedom and empowerment that nature offers them in the present moment of the now in all moments. All time and space is folded for all of humanity to tap into the wisdom, peace, freedom and empowerment that nature offers them in the present moment of the now in all moments. Humanity shifts its paradigm from genuflecting to a man-made God to prostrating its reverence to nature in all moments. Humanity shifts its paradigm from genuflecting to a man-made God to prostrating in reverence to nature in all moments. Humanity shifts its paradigm from genuflecting to a man-made God to prostrating in, reverent, in reverence to nature in all moments. Humanity shifts its paradigm from genuflecting to a man-made God to prostrating in reverence to nature in all moments. Humanity shifts its paradigm from genuflecting to a man-made God to prostrating in reverence to nature in all moments. Humanity shifts its paradigm from genuflecting to a man-made God to prostrating in reverence to nature in all moments. Tree kind is revered for its constant tr contribution to humanity in all moments. Tree kind is revered for its constant contribution to humanity in all moments. Tree kind is revered for its constant contribution to humanity in all moments. Tree kind is revered for its constant contribution to humanity in all moments. Tree kind is revered for its constant contribution to humanity in all moments. Tree kind is revered for its constant contribution to humanity in all moments. All false equivalents between might and right are collapsed, dissolved, and dissipated in all moments. All false equivalents between might and right are collapsed, dissolved, and dissipated in all moments. All false equivalents between might and right are collapsed, dissolved, and dissipated in all moments. All false equivalents between might and right are collapsed, dissolved, and dissipated in all moments. All false equivalents between might and right are collapsed, dissolved, and dissipated in all moments. All false equivalents between might and right are collapsed, dissolved, and dissipated in all moments. I'm going to add one more, and this is it. All energetic mercenaries are immediately retired in all moments. All energetic mercenaries are immediately retired in all moments. All energetic mercenaries are immediately retired in all moments. All energetic mercenaries are immediately retired in all moments. All energetic mercenaries are immediately retired in all moments. All energetic mercenaries are immediately retired in all moments. Take a deep breath. <clears throat> That was quite the marathon, Jen. Yeah, I'm going to just sing a little vibration just to, so we've been really together in the higher. I'm just going to like do some, some buffering so people can tolerate their day and everything after this. And tomorrow we might not be together. I'm no prophet and I don't know nature's ways. <laughs> <laughs> but now I look into your eyes right now and stay right there because these are the good old days these are the good old days Just a little more. In the arms of an angel, far away from here, 
in this dark old hotel room and this helplessness that you fear we are thrown from the wreckage of our quiet revelries in the arms of an angel may you find some comfort there. Thank you, babies. Yep. Yeah. Are we going to chat with the attendees? Um, yeah, feel free to jump off mute um, and just share with us for a couple of minutes as we wind down. Uh, it's been quite the marathon. Um, but, you know, the good thing about doing this, and I know that it is a bit of a marathon, but the thing is that we can, um, it's fairly concentrated work and it just kind of puts a lot of intense intention on uh, the work and it needs to be done. Someone needs to do it. So we're doing it here and um, for the uh, all of humanity to benefit. So um, where I go is, you know, individuals have passions for like animal lovers or the 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 earth or the indigenous people or a certain demographic. Imagine feeling that passion and 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 feel that suffering of all of them all at once to release it. So every time you watch this commercial that says send your money here to help stray dogs or wants you to get on the bandwagon for a certain issue they're all important how do you choose how do you know which is the best anyone who wants to help these issues can come here to these sft tapping events and it covers the whole gamut of any demographic that is suffering out there any individual any any sect or group, and it frees that stronghold of victimization it has on any group. So this is the way to free yourselves from having to feel all that pain and to um, internalize it in the body, if that makes sense. Mm. How, I'd like to know how some of the, uh, like Denise, Catherine, Carol, and um, even Jeff, how, how you guys, um felt doing this does anybody want to they're still all on you mute babies should understand that you're all on mute so. you have to remove yourself from mute if you want to say something it's uh that was very very powerful you know, thank you yeah i think uh if any message got out there, if that didn't get get out, I don't know what's going to get out. So, so what's really interesting, thank you for that. And what's really interesting is this session is a precipice for the one we're going to do on Christmas and New Year's. So all of these tasks are choreographed with the adepts, higher consciousness to move humans into more joy, love, abundance, freedom, health, success, security, companionship, creativity, peace, life, wholeness, beauty, enthusiasm, contentment. Ah, so, took a breath. yeah, sorry. My lungs are a little trapped still, babies. I got to work on my lungs. Yeah. Actually, that's a good point. Um, we do have an upcoming group SFT tapping event, not dissimilar to this one on uh, Christmas Day. Obviously, December the twenty fifth. I think it's at um, I think it's at three p.m. New York time. But just jump onto the Genuine Healing website if you're unsure. Uh, register for that. Um, uh, by the way, thanks for all the donations of those that are on the call that uh, donated. Really appreciate that. It's a great way of adding your synergy to the energy work. Um, so we've got a group yeah, tapping event you. on December the twenty fifth. We've got one. Uh, on January the 1st, so New Year's Day. Uh, mm -hmm. I think, again, it's 3 p.m. New, New York time. But, again, just check on the website and work out what time that is for you, wherever you are in the world. And can, 
one more thing. Sorry, quick promo. Uh, of course, we've got our upcoming masterclass, and that's that's going to be a three hour event um, mm -hmm. to help all the attendees stop habitually reincarnating. <laughs> that's quite quite the endeavor. So, um, if you're sick and tired of habitually reincarnating, you might choose to reincarnate. But if you're sick and tired of habitually reincarnating. This is the event for you, the masterclass. So, so that. thank you, babies. Yeah, so a fun fact. New Year's Day, you know what the um you know what the intention is of all the fireworks? They're, they're supposed to be fun. Boy. They're actually they're actually programming another generation and programming us to war. I mean it's 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 um taking that that freedom that people felt from being freed from war and internalizing it as war in general. So that's why um, doing the tasks on New Year's Day when everybody is watching the fireworks. I personally hate fireworks. My dogs hate fireworks. My cat hates fireworks. And, and a lot of children hate fireworks because what it does is it brings them back to that fear and trauma of being at the mercy of war. Guaranteed that the people in in war torn areas right now don't want to hear fireworks. What's that tell you? Yeah. True. All right. Yeah. Um, sorry, Carol. Did you want to say something? Yes, I I just want to say how um, honored I am to be able to do these taps, and um, I'm a healer, and I'm sending out love and healing as every time I do these. Yep. So that um, people know how much, in fact, I do love them. Mm. So, and I thank you, Jen. Thank you, thank you. And Marvin, too. Yes, thank, thank you. you, Marvin. We wouldn't be here without Marvin because, well, I would be in Rochester, for one thing. But this technology, all this, he didn't know any of this technology. Marvin is constantly upgrading his technology so he can bring it to more people. Hmm. Now that's not a small feat because because that's part of the male empowerment. Male is converting male energy from taking to giving and just his intention of always, you know, learning to help uplift humanity and water in the gardens and tending to me and the puppies. <laughs> and thank you, Marvin. Thank you, Carol. Thank, thank you, you for uh, the you're welcome. Uh, thank you. Um, we are uh, obviously honored to have you and everyone else on the call with us. And um, we're delighted that others can benefit from this uh, after the fact. So thank you so um, much. Can I just ask a personal favor? Hmm. I don't know if this is too uncomfortable, but I would like to hear Denise and Catherine's sound frequency. I know everyone else's sound frequency. Now I know, I know Carol from social media for years. She's been putting her love and intention with the tabs every day. And same with Catherine and I think Denise too. So I'd like to hear your sound frequency so I can like um, absorb it and internalize it and work with it if you don't mind. Okay, so, so yeah, this is Denise and um, I had a personal session with you and you helped me transform my life and I will be forever grateful and I love you so much and I'm really honored to be here too uh, today and I just want to thank you so much. I I just you and Marvin. Oh, Jen, y'all, <laughs> y'all are just phenomenal. I mean, you're just good people. I, I I can't say enough. You're better than good people. You're you're phenomenal, and I appreciate and love both of you. And I hope you're doing good. And I hope doggies are doing good and <laughs> everything. <laughs> thank uh, you. Update. We love you so too. So the doggies are doing great. So, but thank you for that, Denise. Um, yes, um, I'm. I'm going to assume that you sort of um, keep up with us from time to time on our YouTube channel and just a little goings <laughs> out and about with the doggies. And yeah. So that's a question. Um, we do want to hear from you, Catherine, but we would like to know if you guys benefit from our out in the abouts when we're just being ourselves and just. You know, I'm driving Marvin nuts with spiritual principles when he's just trying to drive <laughs> and everything. Do you guys enjoy that as much as the tapping or is that beneficial? 
Mm -hmm. All right, well, we'll keep doing that. Catherine, do you want to say something, hon? Not don't blow smoke up our ass. Just, just I just need to hear your sound frequency and a little bit about yourself. You're on, You're on mute, mute still. Oh. Can you there. hear me now? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. I've been through a lot of life changes, and um, uh, the one big tap thing thing I did with you was probably a couple years ago now. Uh, I have a hard time, but this is the first time I've been on camera the whole time. Because <laughs> yeah, it's a hard time. I know. Not yeah, not falling asleep or or having to lay down because I hurt so much. So this was like oh. a big deal. Yeah. Okay, good. So I'm going to teach you something really important to your spirituality. When you have this dynamic group of visionaries, and we all are, and we all have love for you right now, you don't want to tell us you hurt. What you right, want right, to do right. is. Sorry. Tell us the best version of yourself and hold it. We're here right now as a magnifying glass for your empowerment. Tell us how wonderful and amazing and dynamic you are. Like Kira told us, Carol told us she was a healer and she sends love to everyone. That intention I can hold, but I can't okay. hold you in pain by when you say okay. hurt, I shut right down. I'm not going to agree with you. Okay. So, so, um, so, so one, so one interesting thing I should probably say is, um, I came across all these um, stories that God had helped me write, oh, some years ago, and we had on a forum that's no longer on the internet. And so God told me, he said that the world needed inspiration. So I'm supposed to put all these stories together and put a book together. It's what I'm supposed to be doing. And when I went through these stories and I held them, I could feel that wonderful energy. It just felt so wonderful. And um, he'd had me write letters to some people years ago he had me work with. And um it was wonderful what he said about me. It was wonderful. I really good. felt good. 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 So yeah. let's just, I'll do one more tap if you don't mind. Can okay. you put everybody on mute? Uh, yeah. Just give me one second. This is important because. Oops, sorry. Just one more. I'm just, <laughs> sorry. I accidentally put you on. I can't even find you. Can you just get yourself off mute, Jen? Good. So, so Catherine is great feedback, but she also took us back into the mental realms and the past inadvertently not understanding that we're in higher realms right now and we want to stay in higher realms. So here's this tap that we're going to do, Marvin. We are the living, breathing book in all moments. We are the living, breathing book in all moments. We are the living, breathing book in all moments. We are the living, breathing book in all moments. We are the living, breathing book in all moments. We are the living, breathing book in all moments. So it is, it's interesting that a lot of people get this nudge from higher consciousness to write a book. What they're being told is that they have a story, they're empowered, and they are their experience is important. Mm. And Absolutely. so it's wonderful. And um, it's not a matter of like, who hears the story, who, you know, it's not about mass marketing. It's about being the living, breathing book of life, which we are. So that, thank you for that, Catherine. Thank you. All and right. I um, love Denise's little baby. I have to say hi to Denise's little baby. What's her? Can you take Denise off mute? Um, no, but Denise can. Yeah, this go. is Air. What's her name? Air. A I R. Hi, Air. Hi. Because when Air. she runs, she jumps in the air. It's the coolest thing. <laughs> She's so pretty. And hey. and I watched, and I also, Therese, during your session, during the task, Lily, baby Lily was on the bed just sucking it up and stuff. So it's really cute to see the dog kind and cat kind appreciate the work. So thank you, Air. Mm, all right. Um, it has been a marathon session, so uh, it is late for a lot of people. So if you don't mind, we'll wind down. Thank you so much for joining us. We're honored to have each and every one of you on with us. That There's such a synergy in um, being in the same time and space um, with the same intention. So thank you so much for doing that. And uh, we will do the production work on this and we'll benefit all of humanity by putting it out on YouTube. If you oh can help other people find us, please do that. Um, please do that. And so 
8 billion people can benefit from all of the work. Thank you so much. Look forward to catching you all next time. We love you. Please feel our love.